Google Pixel 3 user asks for refund. Says he got 10 phones later Google mistakenly sent a Pixel 3 customer 10 smartphones worth around $9,000 after he placed a new order on failing to get a refund for a defective phone. The user wrote on Reddit, Google, I have your phones. You have my money. Let's sort this. Google responded, Thanks for bringing this to our attention. I'll send you a private message. I haven't been happier about a ban. Cubra on ban on TikTok up after Chinese app TikTok was removed from Google Play Store and Apple App Store in India. Sacred Games actress Cubra Say tweeted that she has never been happier about a ban. I can't begin to express my joy to hearing about TikTok being banned in India. The state of derangement was exceedingly painful, her tweet further read. Facebook working on own voice assistant to rival Siri. Alexa Facebook is building its own voice-based AI-powered digital assistant to rival existing ones, including Apple's Siri and Amazon Alexa. Facebook said it aims to make its assistant work across its family of R VR products including Portal, Oculus and future products. Notably, Facebook had launched the M Assistant for Messenger in 2015, which it eventually removed in 2018. People Google how to download TikTok after app banned in India after the TikTok app was removed from Google Play Store and Apple's App Store in India. The Google Trends results showed a surging how to download TikTok query. It was most searched in Kerala, Telangana, Delhi, Tamil Nadu and Karnataka. The ban came after Supreme Court rejected TikTok's plea to stay Madras High Court order of banning the app 5G iPhones to come in 2020 despite Qualcomm settlement. Report Apple will reportedly release 5G iPhones in 2020. Despite settling all patent-related legal disputes with chip maker Qualcomm this year, it's too late for Apple to use Qualcomm's chips this year, the report claimed. Intel, which has now announced it won't develop smartphone 5G chips, was facing problems in developing its 5G chips delaying 5G iPhones to 2020 in the past two. Past two.